This is a mass moving towards us. That doesn't look too pretty either. We have this uh, rain that's coming into play. Most of this at this point is not reaching the ground just yet. We do have some showers trying, but we are so dry at the moment that that rain is evaporating before it hits the ground. We have rain that is hitting the ground back to the west where you see those oranges and yellows. That's more likely able to make the trip from the cloud all the way down. But we're going to see these showers on and off through the uh, night tonight and into tomorrow morning and through the morning. These showers will start to dry up and we'll be left behind with the clouds through much of the day. So we're going to have a cloudy setup for the weekend and the rain's going to be pretty up front for your Saturday. Sunday we start off with some clouds, but those will break up through the day. So we'll clear it out through the day and then I think into Monday we're going to have some bright sunshine around along with some of the warmest temperatures we have seen since back in October. So right now we're looking at some mild temperatures 50 from Pittsburgh to Irwin. You get 52 in Morgantown, 50 in Beaver and then many other locations in the mid to upper 40s at the moment. We have cloudy skies across the region. Those clouds are having a hard time producing that rain just yet. And the biggest problem is our relative humidity. It's 28%. It's very, very dry at this point. And typically you'd want those relative humidity ranges in the 60% and higher to pull off the rain. So we'll get there. We'll see that relative humidity climbing, but at the moment it's quite dry outside. Temperatures tonight will fall down into the low 40s. So with the clouds holding on, I think the heat's going to get trapped in today and we're not going to get a big drop in those temperatures like the last couple of nights, but uh, a mild night gives us a mild starting point for tomorrow and to get those temperatures pretty much area wide into the low to mid 50s. There will be a couple exceptions like up towards Franklin back into Somerset where it might struggle to get out of the 40s, but uh, overall a warmer day tomorrow, but the warming trend is going to continue into Sunday and Monday and even Tuesday. So we're going to warm right into the 70s Monday, Tuesday, and when it comes down to it, both these dry days are looking pretty dry. However, Monday is looking to be the sunniest of the two. So Monday looks fantastic and a certain, certain spring like day. 40 degrees for tonight. You're looking at those rain showers, a mild night, a breezy night across the region, and tomorrow's temperatures will be found in the mid 50s. So a cloudy setup and in the morning we're going to see the showers, but during the afternoon I think we're going to be left behind with just mainly cloudy skies. So it will be a sort of a gloomy looking day like this afternoon turned out to be, but we will start to brighten it up and warm it up Sunday. Monday the sunniest and one of the warmest of the week. We'll have increasing clouds on Tuesday, potentially late in the day, a couple showers there, but most of the rain is going to be held onto Wednesday, Thursday and Friday. And you can see that that rain is going to be coming in with some cooler temperatures attached, but even though these temperatures are cooler, this is still quite warm for this time of year.